it is metal brush so i am degreasing the all parts the scooter which has come from the junkyard so i removed the fork now i am cleaning it <coughs> The inside cup will be like this. This is the inside cup for holding the spring. This is the Lambretelli 150 Series 2 4 and, and Lambi 150 also. I placed the rubber pad here. The upper pad will have little thickness. The lower one will have big thickness. After compression, the pad becomes like this. I already inserted one. You can have a look. This is the maintenance going after degreasing and all. I started fixing fork springs and links. There will be a plastic cup here. You can have a look through this. You have to remove that also for maintenance. I already inserted. The plastic material will be very hard. It has to stop the spring during jerks. So that will be very hard. I am fitting it manually, place the spring, after that, actually the brazing has been done, it becomes detachable, take the support of the wall, now watch, if you, if you try to put this, it won't go easily, so you have to compress the spring for fitment of this link. I have to fit it like this. It is not so difficult. You can fix it with the help of hand. After placing the lower rubber pad, it won't move at all. We have to tighten this one also and finally tighten this one firmly. This is the lower pad, a good quality. The depth must be a little bit more and when you tight it it should go fully and the rubber should not be bulged out it should look as usual there should not be any deformation on the rubber pad on both the sides and place it take the other dust cap and carefully put the nut take the cloth and press it upwards and place the rubber rubber pad here keep it slowly ok once it is gone check for the check for matching of the holes keep the screwdriver ok oh, the holes are exactly matching the pads holes are exactly matching to the holes of the fork now you can watch the diameter of the fork holes are little bit big take the flat washer and take this washer and just tight it ok follow the same method for the lower hole also The spanner size is 10 mm. Tight them slowly. When you feel it is tightened, just leave it there. It is locked, it won't move. The upper pad, which I am tightening. However, I am tightening this.